Hello, and welcome to Like a Native Speaker. In this lesson, I'm going to tell you why your pronunciation sucks. In general, learning a language is a mental skill. You memorize vocabulary, you make sense of grammar. Even listening, you're processing it mentally. But pronunciation is different. Pronunciation is a physical skill. Let me show you the contrast. If I put a word right here, and then I take it away, you can probably remember the word. Maybe not exactly, but you get the shape or the idea. But if I make a sound, for example, you can't look at me and know how to do it. Even if you could see inside my mouth, it wouldn't be enough. You have to feel it yourself. And that's what I mean by a physical skill. You can't just see or observe something. You have to do it. Pronunciation is actually more like sports than it is like language. Let me give you an example. Imagine you spent your whole life watching soccer. You watched the best players like Pele or David Beckham. And you see all of their actions, all of their kicks, all of their strategies. You know soccer, but you've never kicked a ball. If you tried to play soccer, would you be good at it? No, of course not. You have to do it. For your pronunciation to become better, you need to, one, learn the correct mouth positions. A lot of this is physical and experimental. You need to play until it sounds right. Two you need to consciously practice that correct position. And three, you need to consciously practice that correct position. Some dancers say that they could dance in their sleep. They don't need to think about it. It becomes automatic. This is what we want from pronunciation, to become automatic. You don't need to think about it. The correct positions become the natural positions. This only comes with extended aware practice. You need to be paying attention to your pronunciation to be able to commit it to memory so that you don't have to think about it. I want you to try something for a second. I want you to close your eyes and try to touch your nose with your finger. Now, if you're not drunk, that was probably pretty easy. But why? You can't see your nose, you can't hear it, you can't smell your nose, but you know where it is and you can touch it with no problem. This is called proprioception, or basically knowing where your body is in space. It's not feeling or seeing or smelling or tasting or anything, it's a different sense. And proprioception is the key to pronunciation. When you're practicing pronunciation, you need to think about and feel where your tongue is, what your lips are doing, what your teeth are doing, what your tongue is doing, what your jaw is doing, what your voice is doing. You need to pay attention to all of that. And this is because pronunciation is a physical skill, not a mental skill. Most of us don't think about our tongue positions, but Thinking about where we move our mouth and our proprioception, that will help us become more automatic in our pronunciation. So as a quick review, your pronunciation is bad because you treat it like a mental skill, something you can just memorize and be done with it. It is not. It is a physical skill. You have to make the movement, do the practice over and over and over again, just like a soccer player or a dancer. If you practice pronunciation with an awareness of how your mouth is moving, with proprioception, then your pronunciation will improve incredibly quickly. All you have to do is shift the way you think about pronunciation from a mental skill to a physical one. If you liked this lesson, please subscribe for more English videos every week. And I will see you next time.